Crows are territorial hunters who defend their territory throughout the year or only during the breeding season. Famous for their high tool making abilities, they make fishing tools from twigs and leaves trimmed into hooks. A hawk is using its strong legs to hold the crow to the ground and continuously peck to finish off its prey. The surrounding crows rush to peck at the hawk, but those pecks had no effect on this predator. Even though he had to fight back, the crow was still unable to reverse the situation. Seeing the crow's effort, the surrounding crows also intended to rush to the rescue. Before they could act, the eagle threatened and flew away. The crow kept pecking at the baby rabbit in pain, and the mother rabbit, standing next to her, wanted to rush in and save it. But in the end, because of the panic, the mother rabbit had to leave her baby and run away. The baby rabbit looked at the mother helplessly. After trying to resist, the baby rabbit still couldn't get rid of the fierce crow. Seeing that the prey was lying still, the crow pulled the prey into one of its places and enjoyed its work. The snake was surrounded by crows that continuously attack the snake, taking turns to peck the snake's head. But with consecutive dissections, the snake was not detected in time to avoid it and suffered a painful incision. Seeing that the prey had gradually lost its strength, the crows worked even harder to attack the snake even more fiercely. After the good cooperation of the crows, the prey gradually lost consciousness. It no longer had any resistance, but only received the fierce attacks from the crows. The hedgehog curled into the middle of the road. It took the help of the hooded crow to run to the side of the road and stopped and curled up. The hooded crow continued to peck at the hedgehog to urge to push it out of the way. The eagle owl stood on the rock. Behind the black crow stood watching the eagle owl and taking the opportunity to peck at the owl and fly away. Although more and more crows approached, the eagle owl did not mind. They were certainly no match for him. The mother duck and her ducklings are running around, not knowing what they're looking for when they came across a crow. The crow says this and also tries to approach the ducklings, but was quickly discovered by the mother duck and rushed to chase the crow away. Although the mother duck rushed to chase away the crow, it seemed that the crow was fearless and it continued to creep closer. Constantly being chased away by the mother duck, the crow still stubbornly refused to leave and continued to approach. The crow has no intention of giving up and it keeps coming back. A bald eagle stands on a tree branch, observing its prey, when it sees an opportunity and the fish flies down to approach the prey. Their main food is fish, in addition to some surface birds, lizards and even frogs. The paws have a rough sole that have powerful claws to allow the eagle to hold on to its prey. Hooded crow is playing with a mouse. The mouse is not a gentle person and it gives up its attack. Continuously galloping up to attack the predator twice its size, the hooded crow can only dodge the attacks. After dodging for a while, the hooded crow waited for the right moment to attack again. When the rat lost focus, the hooded crow quickly grabbed the rat's tail and pulled it back. Seeing the mouse's weakness in the chasing part, hooded crow took advantage of this and attacked the mouse's tail. Continuously dragging the mouse to become more and more panicked, no more decisive attacks on the target anymore. Even though he was tired from his best escape, the eagle's pursuit, the lizard still couldn't escape. The hare rushed to the crow, causing the crow to panic. Not stopping there, when seeing the crow swooping down to the ground, the rabbit continued to pounce on the crow with delight. Seeing the crow fly up and down again, the rabbit followed each beat to beach the crow. The helpless crow cried out for help from the nearby animal, 
but a nearby crow did not know how to get up and it flew away despite the crow calling for help. While walking slowly, the rabbit changed its target and rushed at the crow, causing it to suddenly fly up and hide. The dog was standing and looking at the peaceful surroundings when the crow approached from the behind the dog. The dog was afraid as usual and turned to look. The crow saw the dog turn and stood dumbfounded and approached the dog. The dog saw it and jumped up to scare the crows, causing them to panic and fly away. They did not stop and continued to approach the dog. But as soon as the dog jumped up, they were afraid to fly away. Repeatedly like that, I don't understand the purpose of the crows approaching the dog. The chickens were standing where the eagle flew down, causing the chickens to run away. The mother hen saw the danger. The mother hen very fiercely attacked the eagle, leaving the eagle no chance to respond. Not stopping, the mother hen continued to attack fiercely, making the eagle stunned and could no longer stand. Sea eagles circle the sky looking for their prey, and a good opportunity to target by the eagle. Not taking action, the sea eagle waits for a good opportunity to attack. Waiting for the prey to come to the surface, the sea eagle determines the correct position of the target. The sea eagle swoops down with its strong legs to grab its prey and fly to the sky. Once the prey is stolen, the sea eagle will steal to a safe place and then start enjoying the prey. Brown snake eagle is a large bird of prey and true to its name, its forte is to hunt snakes. After detecting the snake's location, the brown snake eagle quickly flew to approach its prey in the hope of getting a good meal. Contrary to the usual fear of the prey facing the hunter, the snake keeps an extremely calm attitude and calmly defends itself. By this time, the brown snake eagle has run out of patience and starts attacking its prey. It scratched the snake's body with its claws. However, the brown snake eagle that hunts brown snakes is not immune to snake venom. Not yet attacking the two opponents, was startled away. The war is now officially started. After the rabbit's attack, it's time for the crow to attack again. When the crow attacked back, the rabbit was afraid to run into the dust. The crow approached the bush to look for the rabbit when suddenly the rabbit rushed out to attack the crow and then fled. Not giving up, the crow was still waiting for the rabbit to come out to retaliate. At this time, the rabbit just rushed out to attack. The crow struggled to get away from the cat's teeth, but the cat wasn't so easy for the crow to escape. The fight may have been because the crow was the one who started it first, but the one who took the initiative was now the weaker one. With the fierce struggle of the crow, the cat still did not loosen its vigilance. It still held on to the crow. When the crow was no longer moving, the cat dragged the crow into the bushes. A hawk stands on the tree branch observing his prey. When he sees an opportunity, the eagle swoops down. Stepping on the crow's body and starting to attack, the two sides seem to be evenly matched. Although he tried to attack the predator very fiercely, the crow was still no match for the hawk. After a while of confrontation, the crow became the hawk's delicious prey. In a clash between the hawk and the crow, the musket cutter used its legs to hold the crow's neck and disable its opponent. Unable to reverse the situation, the crow used its beak to cut off the hawk's legs so that it would not be able to attack anymore. The hawk struggled to pull his legs out of the crow's beak, but couldn't. Try to use your wings to repeatedly hit the enemy's face to stun the hawk. But all of the attacks of the crow did not hurt the hawk at all. They just held each other tightly to prevent each other from escaping. 
the great white pelican was standing with a flock of crows, and it swooped down to place the great white pelican. Unfortunately, it immediately grabbed it with its prey. A very easy hunt for the great white pelican. The snake is crawling on the green grass field. The red-tailed falcon saw the appearance of the snake, and it approached. Not intending to attack, the red-tailed falcon just approached and stood by the snake's tail. When he spotted the red-tailed falcon behind him, the snake turned around to try and bite the falcon, but fortunately the falcon evaded it. After chasing the red-tailed falcon away, it slowly crawled back to its safe place. In the snow-covered landscape, the bald eagle is enjoying its delicious prey. In the wild world, the competition for prey always takes place. This bald eagle is no exception. Also indispensable for the presence of wolves, the wolf saw that the prey was already laid out. With the greed of the wolf, it was very strong to strike and rush to bite the eagle. Seeing the ferocity of the wolf, the bald eagle also helplessly left. Hi, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, you know what to do. Hit the like button and subscribe. And of course, if you have any comments, you know where to leave them. I hope to see you again in tomorrow's next great adventure.